All right, let me let me let me put it to Julia Wono now. Uh, this importance of civil society uh, playing playing a major role. I saw that Nigerian stock market surged this Wednesday, uh, and it was not so much an endorsement, it seems, uh, uh, of Mohamedou Buhari, but of Nigeria's institutions. Absolutely, and I want to thank Mr. Mr. Abdu for what he reminds is that at the, at the center of all this. They are citizens who are the, the main actors of, of this election. And uh, I think we can take three lessons, political lessons, from, from this election. The first one is that African heads of state have to stop being afraid of their citizens. I mean, it's not they're not the danger. I mean, they are the progress. And I think that's important to highlight. We don't say it uh, enough. Uh, the second lesson I think we can take from this is that when when uh, the opposition, you know, there, there is a tendency in the, a lot of African countries of, you know, a, di um, a di dispersed opposition with, you know, everybody claiming leadership uh, to, to take over the, the, the main, the main, the incumbent president. But I think that, as Mr. Uh, president Goodluck said, what's more important is beyond, beyond the personal ambitions is the interest of the country. And I think it's also a lesson for opposition parties in, 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 in African countries. And the third, I think, lesson, which is important to take here, is that we have to, 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 we have to go beyond the spree and recognize that finally, also, what has won here is conservatism. Because as you've said, Mr. Buhari, President Buhari is also a military, as uh, Prince Wendy said earlier, uh, is the people needed, you know, someone with who can run the country, who has proved that he can run the country with an iron fist sometimes to to tackle issues. Um, I, I'm not in favor of saying that African countries need strong men. I, I think we we have to go beyond that. But it is true that in in fa fa while facing adversity and while facing danger and while facing huge challenges such as security, economy, corruption, the ones we've talked about, we need someone who has a clear vision and also who is able to, you know, you know, shout when needed to shout.